Now, the last part is um, number D. Using your answers to C3, C3 means uh, what we just did, what we just found. did to uh, find the gradients and uh, like this. So, you have to use this data to determine the value of C. Determine the value of C. So, C is a uh, a data which we uh, used in the at the very front so let us uh, show that also uh, in the meantime and the process we have forgotten that let us see so c is the capacitance c here capacitor c here and it is uh, done by something uh, let me go for the mm, rough works here so 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 that is c is somewhere uh, i think it's over here it's itself here so to find the value of c i might have to use this data so gradient and minus t by c so here uh, first uh, right here right here this m best so m best is equal to the value of m best is equal to 7000 7000 and it's negative negative and uh, from the very first question what we have is what we have is this uh, m is equal to minus t by c so m is equal to minus t by c and this t is equal to 15.0 so minus it is 15.0 by c so which means that which means that c is equal to minus 15.0 by this m so uh, the value of c should be equal to uh, actually c best here is equal to so therefore c best is equal to minus 15.0 by this m is equal to minus seven thousand thousand and lots of other quantities as well so this should be equal to 15 divided 7 thousand equal to it is 2.14 2.14 1428 something into 10 to the power minus 3 so it's equal to 2.14 into 10 to the power minus 3 now what we require here is we require some sort of unit here as well unit here so the unit of c will be equal to uh, the division of uh, division of the unit of this uh, 15 which is second and this slope so let's go for the unit of the gradient so if i do it here if i do data here so you have to plot this against this the x axis y axis so unit of slope is equal to s unit by this unit its unit is simply its unit is uh, uh, simply 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 a number number which means that it has no unit its unit is uh, ten by, uh, it is uh, per ohm so 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 the unit of slope is equal to of slope is equal to equal 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 to uh, unit of of t is equal to second unit of m b is equal to equal to number by this equal to ohm number by so it is actually a number divided divided uh, ohm minus one equal to simply ohm so its unit should be equal to this is second this is ohm so it's equal to second per ohm second per ohm is its unit now i have to cal calculate the percentage uncertainty in the value of c so therefore the percentage uncertainty in c is equal to delta c by c into 100 percent equal to delta c is i need to find out here so since i have this formula here cb is equal to is equal to uh, uh, minus t by uh, minus t by m the formula is here so delta c by c should be equal to delta t by t plus delta m by m m into 100 percentage so equal to equal to delta t is a given quantity so it has got no error the only thing is this delta m by m so delta m is equal to the real value of delta m is equal to as you can see from here this thing here the real value delta n is minus 543 point so let's copy from here copy from here it is uh, 543 point point eight five nine six eight five nine six divided this m is uh, 7000 7000 into 100 percentage so equal to so when i do the calculations it will be equal to equal to 543.8596 divided 7000 equal to into 100 equal to so it is 
0.7694 so nearby we have to express this in terms of 2SF 2SF so that's why the value should be equal to 7.8 percentage so it is 7.8 percentage percentage uncertainty now the last one the last one so the last is uh, determine of the value of R for which the capacitor will discharge to 10% of its original PD uh, in 15.0 seconds. So we have to find a new value of R, new value of R which will um, require so that uh, the capacitor will discharge to 10% of the original value of PD. So what we have is uh, this uh, new V is equal to 10% of the original v that is v naught so let's apply in the equation equal to v naught e minus t by uh, cr or rc uh, cr let us say so this and this goes 10 percent is simply uh, 0 0.1 so we have got <clears throat> so or i'll have uh, this is 0 0.10 should be equal to e to the power minus t by cr if i take log of both ln ln of both so it will be equal to ln 0 0.10 equal to equal to minus t by cr minus t by cr uh, t by cr so this will be equal to uh, this will be equal to or let us say i need to find the value of uh, r here value of r here so this uh, r should be equal to minus t by c t by c into into uh, 1 by ln 0 0.10 and this uh, minus t by c is equal to this minus t by c is equal to equal to equal to simply simply if we go through the first question first question minus t by c is simply equal to the gradient so it will be equal to m equal to this is m so it is m by ln 0 0.10 is equal to equal to so it is a 0.1 ln sorry sorry ln 0.1 equal to so it is uh, minus minus uh, 2.3026 there are lots of values but i'll use this only so now <coughs> let's calculate the value so this r best is equal to r best is equal to uh, m best by by minus 2.3026 so our m best is equal to minus 7000 by 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 minus 2.3026 equal to so divided uh, 7000 minus sorry sorry anyway it is a uh, 7000 divided 2.3026 equal to it is 3040.04 something something uh something something value uh so then so it is a 3040 3040 here then then uh we have to find the uncertainty also so delta r by r is equal to from this relation is equal to delta m by m because this has got no error so therefore delta r is equal to delta m by m into r and this delta m by m is equal to as we did previously it was uh, uh, somewhat like this only was equal to 0 0.077694 something like that so let's do the calculations so it is uh, i can just do the whole calculation here 543 0.8596 by by 7000 into r is uh, 3040.04 so equal to uh, into 543.8596 divided 7000 equal to so it is 236 so when it is done in 2 sf it is equal to 240 so it is plus plus minus plus minus 240 240 
then it should be written up to uh, what I have to do is so it is 240 here 240 here it is 3040 here 40 here so I need to write only up to this thing so it is 3000 plus minus 240 240 and uh, the unit is written well over here so it is ohm the unit of resistance is definitely this is ohm so this finishes our job but one thing that we have to remember is when we write units of different things here if you know the quantity uh, we can directly write those write the unit so uh, here you can see it is C here uh, you see is the capacitance actually capacitance so if you know the unit you can write, write just write the unit for capacitance uh, so which is equal to farad so here it is if you write second per ohm or farad it's okay it's okay both are correct and if you don't know it yes you like you write this way so knowing is better and if you don't know then also uh, writing this way would be a better thing thank you